It's Logan. Nice to meet you uh, with Live Free Investments here. And I talked about in the welcome video, really starting with the end in mind. And I believe that you have to have a plan and you have to know where you're going or any route will take you there. And so my why, uh, that's what I want to talk about in this video. I want you to get to know me just a little bit more. And one of my mentors, the great Zig Ziglar, said you can have everything in life that you want if you'll just help another enough other people get what they want. And that's really been a guiding principle for me in life is to try to help others get what they want. And uh, I see a lot of joy and I get a lot of joy out of that. So my why is to help other people get uh, what they want and, and, and just show them that they can rise above the mediocrity and uh, perform at a really, really high level and, and they don't have to go down the alternative or they don't have to go down the regular route in life. And uh, my faith, my family, uh, my future, my fitness, and my fun are my guiding values and principles in life. And that's my why. So I do everything that um, I need to every single day for my faith, try to get my, myself to heaven and everybody else around me to heaven, and then my family. Uh, my beautiful wife, and we have a uh, our first baby coming soon. So uh, my family is my next one, and then my my you know my friends and my fitness and my fun and I love food. And you can see here there's a there's a live free f uh, theme here um, with food, fitness, family, faith, fun, future. And uh, one of my mentors also told me that you know life is like a three legged stool, and you know what you have to have all three things in your life really, really strong, or you're going to start falling apart. And that was your faith, your family, and your future uh, in place. And so I'm here because five years ago, I started my journey on this path of trying to understand how to get to an alternative way of living and um, be financially free and have a passive income coming in. And I tried a lot of different things. I researched a lot of different things and talked to a ton of people. And the best thing that I found was real estate. And so I did my first live-in flip uh, five years ago. Ever since then, I've been learning about real estate, doing bigger deals um, and getting uh, some some larger assets under management and, and um, helping our investors do the same. And so uh, I want to talk about that with you. And I want to talk about how we can align our visions. And, um, you know, I, I tell a lot of people too, I'm not going to work with everybody. And uh, I'm only going to work with people that I really like because life's too short to be uh, deceived and life's too short to be working with people who um, are just going to try to get everything out of you and not um, and not bring you any value. So, so that's what I'm here to do on the other side is to bring you value and help you understand uh, and, and really simplify real estate for you. Uh, and and try to try to guide you along this process. And I'm not gonna have all the answers. I'm still learning every single day. I, I'm a learn it all, not a know it all. And so I'm gonna learn along this process as well. So if we're doing something new together, just know that uh, I'm gonna be here learning with you. Um, but I think that uh, Darren Hardy talks about you know you have to allocate a certain percentage of your income for your personal and professional development. And about again five years ago, I started this journey of of doing his. Um, living your best year ever journal and journaling every single day and having an accountability partner in my life and mentors and coaches. And again, I think that you can get fa farther faster by standing on the shoulders of giants. And so um, I'm passionate about talking about that. I'm passionate about my faith, talking about my family, talking about different ways, different books. You can see Jocko Willink's book here, Extreme Ownership, is one of my favorite books that I've ever read. All my real estate books are just right up here. So I'm actively reading. And um, I love my office. I tell people my office is the cornerstone of this home because uh, it allowed me to get to this beautiful home because of the education that I, I provided uh, to myself, really. And you can't stop learning after college. Yeah, I got a master's degree. I got an undergrad degree. But if you stop learning after you go to college, that's when you start, stop growing. And um, we've all heard the term learners are earners. And uh, Leaders are readers. And, and yeah, those things are corny, but they are true. And I believe in them a lot. So uh, you're always going to see me, my head in a book. And um, that's me. I want to give you a little background about me. I grew up in Jefferson City, Missouri, which is the capital of Missouri for everybody who doesn't know that. I have two sisters, Reagan and Kellen, a beautiful mother, Karen, uh, my grandma, Shirley, 
I lost my dad to drugs and alcohol about four and a half, five years ago now. And so, um, you know, I have a lot of uh, passion around um, that story as well that I'm, I'm happy to share with you and, and um, give my faith journey as well with you. And I'd, I'd like to talk with you about that because that's what life's all about. So I grew up playing sports. You know, I, I went to high school, was the captain of the football team, went on to college, captain of the football team there for a couple of years, um, learned discipline, focus, mentality, work ethic, persistence, and um, it was great. I loved the sport of football before for those reasons. Now I'm a Kansas City Chiefs fan, so Patrick Mahomes is killing it right now. If this video is old, I apologize, but right now we're 3-0, and so go Chiefs. And uh, I moved to Kansas City, was a franchise consultant with Jimmy John's for 25 years, sorry, for 25 stores here in Kansas City, managed those and kept the brand consistent across the board. I then jumped ship uh, after I hit a glass ceiling really, really early with them and went over and started working with a startup company selling um, a, a service and a, and a product to large trucking firms. And I had a great career there and met a lot of great people. I was introduced to my wife and one of my best friends there. So that was wonderful. I left there and went back to the hospitality industry and started selling customer experience, customer experience management uh, and services to restaurant brands, which I which I enjoyed. A uh, private equity firm came on. I actually got let go, and that's when I started full time in real estate uh, last December, I suppose it was. So it's been a, quite a journey for me. Um, I've done deals while I was uh, going through all those different transitions as well. But now I'm full time uh, real estate investor and helping other people do the same thing. So um, we live in Kansas City. And uh, we primarily invest in the Kansas City market. Haven't really moved because there's a lot of opportunity here. And uh, if you need to know why there's opportunity here, I'll talk to you about that as well. But that's a little bit about me. I uh, hope that gave you an insight into who I am. Let's connect. Let's talk a little bit more. Uh, I'd love to meet. If you come to Kansas City, I will take you to get some of the best barbecue, which is debatable, but it actually comes out of my backyard right here. Uh, no, just kidding. Jack Stack is uh, my favorite restaurant here in the city, and uh, we'll talk about that if you if you come, and we'll take you and we'll get you some barbecue. So um, let's talk. Reach out to me, and I uh, look forward to connecting with you. Have a great day. Live free.